The downgrade of Namibia's economy to junk status is keeping all economic role players on their toes to come up with the necessary interventions to steer the economy out of the doldrums. Nedbank's leadership advises that everything be done to ensure that jobs are not sacrificed through the austerity measures introduced. We are all geared as a bank and as, as corporate citizen, we geared to support the government. Um, we geared to protect jobs in, in our, from a Nedbank perspective. And uh, some of the pain people don't like when we have to cut here and cut there and maybe think differently about how do we do business. But the focus on the customer and supporting the customer in, uh, in this, and whether it's a public sector customer, a private sector customer, whether it's government, it is critical that we support our customers. And uh, as banks, as life insurance companies, um, as asset managers, we hold government debt. Moody's downgrade last week of the economy attracted different reactions. And President Hagi Gengob says the rating agency has failed to take into consideration the debt curbing measures the country had introduced, such as cuts to the national budget and unnecessary spending. The rating agency cited reasons like inability to honor both domestic and foreign debt and to raise sufficient revenues to fund expenditure. Namibia has targeted a below 30% debt to the gross domestic product, but now stands at around 41%. This is well below the SADC regional target of about 60%. Very, very difficult decisions we took. Mm. So we're not condemning questioning motives. We are saying you should recognize what we are doing. Yeah. We are about to be out of that uh, problem and they are saying you are not doing anything. Yeah. That's what we are questioning. Yeah. That they should have very really see what is going on yeah. and wait for the budget review yeah. October. And they will see what we have done. Nedbank's insurance to government follows another financial institution, Bank Ventuk's call to devise ways to avoid job losses at all costs while reviving the economy. But now is the time for me, and this is the very same conversation we have in Nedbank, not to point fingers and, and, and look for culprits. Now is the time to hold hands and say, how do we take this storm together? How do we charter through these choppy waters? And how do we get on the other side 